I think if we can just take this one guard out and this dog out, it should be should be fine. Uh, rough. Woo. Try hyper bear grenade. Holy shit, that just killed- it didn't kill them, it- oh, damn it. It not- how did that kill them? It says the hyperbaric grenade doesn't kill it. Well, we are experimenting. We are experimenting, that's fine. We might actually just not be able to kill these guys. We might just have to sneak directly by them. How are we going to kill this last guy? I think he's just... Uh... Holy shit, chat. These guys are... Intense. Let's try just jumping down and choking this one guy out. That kind of worked. Now we can kill this dog. Let's move his body as well so that people don't find him. Rough, rough. And we should be able to get the whale oil from right over here. Yeah. And we can use this whale oil to power a painter's lift, which will take us to the very top of this building. Which should be pretty effective. Can't see me. I am a ghost. All right, perfect. And hopefully, before we do that, we're going to look at this cliff over here because we have a mission to see what's going on with it. The person died down there. That sucks. Kind of predictable, but that sucks. Oh, this is a sanitation area key. So if we wanted to sneak, there's like four, there's like three or four different ways you can actually get in the bank. This is the only one that's really viable for the completely silent playthrough that we want to do. It looks like this guy fell off with the key trying to get, trying to get some valuable watch or something it sucks Woo! 
All right. So we're going to save it here. We should be able to just go all the way to the top of the building without being seen. I think. Nice. Okay. There's several guards up here that we're going to have to take care of. Oh. Before we can actually dump the stuff down into the drain. Let's try it real quick. One right here. I believe there's two over here. One. Maybe just, oh, two, there he is. Go ahead and grab this uh, bone charm that's over here as well. Somewhere, there it is. Actually never upgraded our bone charm slots, which kind of sucks. Let's keep the Undertaker one because that allows us to much more successfully get away with carrying bodies. Okay, that was pretty smooth. That worked well. Okay, let's dump this toxic da gas down the... <laughs> down the ventilation shaft. And that should knock literally everyone out in this entire bank. And now we can go to sword that we can then use to kill the outsider. Or in this playthrough, this no-kill playthrough. Not kill the outsider. I'm in. Easy. Now for the difficult part. Easy. Yeah, that was so easy. I need to stay quiet. All right, so they're all knocked out. Still wake up if I make too much noise. But they're only barely knocked out. And since we actually have a quest to not hurt anyone in the entire bank, we can't choke them out either because we want to make this contract. We want to fulfill this contract just because it's better too. We get more money for it, that sort of thing. We're gonna go ahead and do that. But we will loot them all. Which will work out great. So the first thing we need to do is... Open all of these security doors. And the way to do that is in this... Uh, behind these gates. So if we just go down one floor from here, we'll easily be able to do it. Right here. We're also going to raid their cash register while we're here. Oh, yeah, that's right. I forget there's no cash in this one. We're going to raid this cash register while we're here.
And then, if we go straight in through here, we'll get killed by these electrical things. We have to go in through the side door and disable them in the correct manner. These things. I don't know why we just used that. <laughs> We're just gonna take the power sources out of them. There's two options here. We can either take the power sort off, source off to completely disable them, or we can rewire them so that they uh, kill any of our enemies and we can just walk straight through them. Obviously we're doing a no-kill run, so we don't want, want them to kill any of our enemies. We want to be able to just walk straight through them. All right, and this is where it starts to get hard. So we're gonna do a hard save right here. Okay. There's one of these creepy clockwork soldiers here, as of course there always is in Dishonored. We need to go ahead and disable this electric gate by going all the way down here. That must be the vault. It's some kind of fancy elevator. A control room can move the vault into two places. I need to find a way to move that thing, one way or another. Wow, those things are really, really perceptive. So we need to make sure that we wait for it to progress a little farther across the room before we actually go out and jump to our next teleportation spot. Huh. It actually jumped us to a, our last auto save and not our last hard save. That's kind of weird. That must be the vault. It's some kind of fancy elevator. A control room can move the vault into two places. I need to find a way to move that thing, one way or another. Okay, that should get us by it. We're gonna loot all of their stuff while we're here, get plenty of money. To buy plenty of delightful goods to murder people with. Or, I guess just choke people out with, but. So as you see, they're all just gently asleep. Ooh, an apricot tart sounds really good right now. Oops. Okay, so we disabled the How the hell did it see me? Is there two of them? I do not remember there being two of them. Come on! Ugh. There were literally not two of them ten seconds ago when we were 
running around the thing. Let's look over there now and see if there's still two. There is. There's still two. wonder why that is. I hate these things. Why are they smiling? What? Weird. This is not going at all how it went last time. Let's try just rewiring it this time. Let's see if that works better. We are getting there. We're also going to look, when we enter this time, we're going to look around for that second Blockwork Soldier. So there's not one here. Where the hell is the other one? Maybe it doesn't spawn in until you take the... That must be the vault. It's some kind of fancy elevator. A control room can move the vault into two places. I need to find a way to move that thing. One way or another. That's kind of strange. But there's definitely not a second Clockwork Soldier out there right now. Let's try just rewiring it. What the hell? Where did that thing come from? New clients will receive unlimited traps on their primary Michael's account and a set of Cirilla cookie knives. Join today. And a set of Cirilla cookie knives. All right, that should do it. Looks like we got past it this time. Is he coming back this way? I think he is. We're gonna have to wait until he patrols all the way forward and then all the way backwards again in order to get to the elevator. is very close to where I'm standing. I hate these things. Why are they smiling? Why can we not jump to this thing? It's really weird. So normally, that was a bug. You're supposed to be able to jump through. Oh, wait.
You're supposed to be able to jump through metal bars, but it wouldn't let us jump through them that time, which is really strange. Okay, so first let's go to the archives downstairs. There is a contract that we complete can complete down here. by hacking into someone's lockbox. No rewire tool available, shit. Hmm. That's really not good. We need a rewire tool really badly. So the password of this is someone's, the, their favorite date. Also, I think this is the contract that we need to fulfill. Rags to riches. And the password to it should be 315. Like that contract just said. 315. Nice. And we should find out this person's favorite date by the, looking looking at this book. 28th of May. I think so. 283 is the passcode. Oh, let's also look around in here for a rewire tool. Damn, doesn't look like there is one. That's gonna make the end of this a lot harder. Ooh, we almost stepped on that guy. That was almost really bad. Two, eight. Seven, two, eight, seven. And lots of money. New clients will receive unlimited nice. crafts from their primary Michaels account and a set of Sevilla cookie knives. Join today. Yeah. I don't think there's a way to craft these rewire tools either. Which is really unlucky. Should have bought more when we had the chance, I guess. 